Hello everybody, this is from the cabin slash house in uh, in South Lake Tahoe, California, day two of my vacation, and I tell you, it's pretty cool. This place has Wi-Fi, which means I'm able to re record this reaction. Today we are looking at episode one of season 15 of Red vs. Blue. Hold up. And it's titled Prologue. It's eight minutes long, and we are just gonna get on with the video. Let's do this. Every action has an equal and opposite reaction. Yep. Big Newton, buddy. Uh huh. You touch my big beans, I put dog shit in your pillowcase. Action, reaction. <laughs> rule number one. Got it. Don't touch your beans. Rule number two. Every other person in this miserable place is literal garbage. Don't talk to them, don't listen to them, don't become cute friends with them. Got it. No friends. Rule number three. Keep your radio on at all times. Hey, but oh boy. Your radio's off. I'm busy. Something tripped the motion sensor one floor down. Command wants you to take a look. Fucking command. Do I look like a goddamn exterminator? Vargas, show this bunny around. <laughs> what? He's, uh, always like that. What's a funny? <laughs> oh, by no bar. No. That's Caboose. What are you doing, Caboose? No, I don't want to fight anyone. Ain't that the whole appeal? Tuition. When I get out, I'll have a full ride to the college of my choice. I'm going to be a botanist. Botanist, huh? Well, I've never much trusted robots myself, but that's just because I grew up in the South. Out here, your main enemy is boredom. Boredom and a CEO who really loves putting dog shit in telekeys. I anticipated the boredom. That's why I brought along some books on tape. Looks unsafe. What's the feel of that? Don't pages get stuck together? Oh! Oh, God! Woo! Where did you go? What did you do? Oh, God! What is happening? I don't, what's, I don't understand what's happening. What is happening? What is this? And that's the thumbnail for episode one. The capital in chaos. As you can see behind me, UNSC police are swarming the scene of a brazen late night heist. We're told the attack has taken the lives of a dozen UNSC guards with untold millions in industrial goods stolen. The UNSC has not identified suspects. However, the limited surveillance footage obtained by this reporter confirms an ugly surprise. The reds and blues have struck again. And cut. Got it. Is that a wrap? Let's pack it up. I want to get inside for the next pickup. Inside where? They're going to shoot us. They're not going to shoot us. Follow my lead and when in doubt, use a confusing acronym. <laughs> Confusing acronym? Gonna have to ask you to turn around and go back where you came. This is a restricted military AO. At eight, soldier. We're BADDAD. Bomb action detection, decision, and diffusion. Bomb squad? You guys just left. That was RAR. Rapid action response. We're FIAT. Forensic identification analytic tech. I'm Corporal Pagina, and this is Lance Corporal Tucroy. Yeah, stand by. I'm gonna have to run this up the chain. No time. We have a live LOL RPG upstairs with a CPRD of over 5,000. Oh, that's a lot. We're expecting an LSAT RT double the next eight minutes. <laughs> okay, that sounds pretty big. Class 1, F-U-B-A-R, F-O-S-H-O. He doesn't say a whole lot, does he? <laughs> he's a French analysis repair transfer. No English, but he's with SL cars, DDR, and the entire AOL. Ain't that right, Decroy? Sweet. <laughs> All right, you better make it quick. <laughs> It's 
or five thousand. <laughs> Many experts have concluded the Reds and Blues are attacking the UNSC on behalf of a free chorus. Since its rediscovery, the small colony has insisted on remaining independent from the rest of the galaxy, a demand that does not sit well with the members of the UNSC. These recent attacks have only complicated the negotiation process, and the UNSC has threatened extreme measures if the attacks do not stop immediately. Public opinion has shown increasing support for military intervention. Who are these people? Hey, who the hell are you two? We're documenting. We're with UNSC Intelligence. Who are you? Intelligence, huh? We'll see about that. Stay where you are! Follow me. Oh, no. We need to leave. They're gonna lock us up a door with it. Can it? Are you rolling? Christ. Speed. Yep. Which brings us to the events of last night. The Reds and Blues invaded the secure supply depot, leaving no survivors to tell their tale. They took whatever they came for and left behind a grotesque symbol of their butchery. No answers will be found here tonight. Only more questions. What are they up to? And what is their endgame? Breathe! You are under arrest! That's a wrap. Huh. Maybe next time, I'll let you rot. Maybe next time, I saw the story would be the end. You know your offer was open-ended. I'll just do it already. For what I'm paying you, I can float a new department and give myself a big boy ring. Oh, uh, don't forget, you'll also have a lot more room in your office without my awards cluttering the place. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> talking to God's I like her, even though I don't know who she is. I've been down and kissed your boots. How's that? We can start over. You can agree to cover the follow-up. Grumpy McBossy Pants. <laughs> 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 How am I going to support my ex-wives without my job? There's a story here, and I want to be the one to chase it down. You're taking swaps at windmills, Andrews. The reds and blues are all loose people. People are bored of them. Why don't you do a story about those monster fighting sexy teenagers? Yeah! The kids love those movies. The Power Rangers? Really? Or is that what he's talking about? Please, no, wait. Or Ruby. I think they're talking about Ruby. I don't know. Ten months ago, every journalist, talk show host, and shitty internet blogger would have sold a kidney to interview those guys. But they disappear. Now they're just everyday criminals. These facts. These characters don't have the depth you Jesus. I profiled the Reds and Blues after Project Freelancer. I know them. This change in their design must be motivated by something big. Oh, you're such a pain in my cojones. Every time you start on one of these damn crusades, I start pissing kidney stones like hail. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> two weeks, Carlos. I'm not asking for the moon. You want two? You got what? You want rope? You'll give me enough to hang myself with. Thanks a million, honey bucket. And I want daily dispatches. I want to know every step you take and how much shit gets stuck on your shoes and in between your teeth. Of course. So, where to first, Quixote? I'll start where Agent Washington did when he tracked down the Reds and Blues. Blood Gulch? At the beginning. Okay. Oh, it's about, oh. oh, that's it? Oh. Man, that was an interesting way to start. But I'm confused. What the hell is going on with the with the with, the, with my favorite characters out there, man? What is going on? I just I don't I don't I don't know. Uh and who was that guy who that all all white armored guy? Took off the helmet and left it on the floor. Who the hell is that guy? Man. Ah. Uh, I was kind of expecting the premiere to be a little longer, to tell you the truth. But I'm guessing they're going slow on this. Mm-hmm. So. This video, by the way, was was recorded on April 2nd. But well, it's not released until April 9th. Fun fact. April 9th is my birthday, so if this video is even out on, on April 9th, happy birthday to me. And also, what do you guys think about this? What do you think is going to happen? Alright, that's about it, you guys. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all later.